never get enough track oh! Oh! What's good? Monday, baby. Fresh start Monday. Mental Monday. Mild psychosis Monday. Make it happen. Making gains. Making moves, baby. I got the moves. Monday, what's good? Yo, I've been sleeping decent, but I think because I'm doing these podcasts first thing in the morning, I'm starting to feel that in the mornings, I'm my mind is racing before I wake up and then I can't sleep. It's like five in the morning and I can't sleep anymore. But then I'm like half in and out. It's weird. So I might need to kind of fix that because that's kind of, it's like my brain's turning on before I wake up, which I like, which I like, but I need that recovery sleep. Welcome to Dunk Life Daily, the one and only podcast brought to you by motherfucking Mother Earth. Yeah, so there's that. And uh, yeah, we're doing it and we're feeling good. I played a pickup yesterday on baby rims, a new court that has baby rims. It's um, unbelievable because the court's not slippery. It was a lot of fun. Isaiah Rivera, the monster man, Monday man himself was there. He fucking killed it. Sneak peek in the footage yesterday. I told him like we couldn't we couldn't catch a dunk in the game. And he dunked so goddamn easy. I'm like, yo, I'm going to blow by my guy because I'm quick as shit. Okay, I'm quick as fuck. I got no handles, but I'm quick. I've been dunking for a while. My explosivity is through the roof. So like one hezzy and I'm fucking gone. Like if you're watching a podcast, I'm gone. Um, so I said, yo, I'm going to go down the middle. I'm just going to throw it backwards, like right by the middle of the rim. Just, just destroy. He's like, okay, next play fucking destroys it. It was just, it was just, he caught it with two hands and just destroyed it. But I wanted to give you that insight. So when you see the footage, you'll, you'll know that I, t- I hopefully in the footage, you could see me talking to him and I'll mention it, but it's just funny that we set that up and it worked so well. I had an attempting game. I got stuffed again, but it was from a weird angle. And the, I don't like when the competition's low. I, someone was guarding me who can't really, it was really slow. And it's, I play bad when I play worse people. I know that sounds like an excuse, but it's just because I'm, I'm in my head so much. I'm like, I should be able to blow by this guy. I should be able to do this. And I can't, when I'm on the underdog, I play really well. Like the mindset I was talking about yesterday, I know I do so well when I'm the underdog because I'm loose, I'm free, I don't have, I don't have, I have no, uh, no losses. I only win-win situation. If I do bad, that's what happens. If I do well, it's even better. Okay. Uh, the other thing is that at my mug, Mug Monday, my stupid ass mug got on house of highlights. <laughs> I was joking around saying that. Uh, put the energy out there. You want to be on house of highlights because I've been on there before, like recording and in the background and stuff, but they put my face (laughs) for some reason as the thumbnail. So it's like, I made it on there for real this time, but I want to be on there for my own, uh, for my own skills. Um, but it's funny cause it's like you, I just, but it did remind me of the saying or the, the philosophy, whatever that Casey Neistat kind of taught me, which is like, he made it to MIT, that really uh, prestigious school. Right. But he didn't make it there with grades. His YouTube got so big and he had such good ideas that he got to be a student there and use their facilities. And he's actually using it for research and things like that. But it's like, you don't know how you're going to get there, but you can, you can get to those things and everybody's path is a little bit different. So there's your little nugget for the day of to lift up your spirits, make your spirits more mental and mutual magnificent Monday. Okay. So you don't know how you're going to get there. I, I don't really count that for me, but it reminded me of that theory. Uh, what else was I wanted to talk about? Uh, so yeah, my ham, sh- I jumped a ton. I tried a bunch of dunks, sneak peek for my YouTube fam on the story. If you saw that, uh, and on here, I'll let you know, I hit a little bit of a 360. I tried to spin a little bit more than usual and I did. And I dunked it with one hand instead of two. So that was good. My reverses suck, but they got better. Uh, windmill off the dribble first try really good. And that's it. And shout out to the people who copped my dunk program, my two week jumping high program. It, it's just a primer two weeks to get you jumping your highest. If you just want something to follow something to be like, you know what? I want to max out what I can do in two weeks. That's what it is. It's only 20 bucks. It's half off for the dunk life listeners. Well, that sale ended, but I am going to give, uh, it's only 20 bucks. I'm going to give away one free one to somebody on this video. Cause I want to keep you guys, um, what's it called? The priority. So if you, if you comment on this video, I'm going to give one away and I'm going to do that often because I want to keep rewarding. I want to give it away to everybody, but I can't because I spent a lot of time on it. And so anybody who comments, I'm probably going to use a random commenter thing and drop you guys a free program. So there it is. And I'm also developing a, a full, I have a strength phase that I'm going to drop today. Woo! And then, um, which is cheaper if you sign up for my dunk life membership. But if you just want the actual program, I got you. And then three months, six months, I'm going to try to make a big, big program 
that I feel good about. And all my programs come with the Selly guarantee for my Selly psychos. They, they come with me. If you, if you, you're going to get results, if you can't, if something's struggling, I'm going to help you myself personally. And I'll use my time for you guys. Cause I really want to make sure that you benefit from this. Um, I give all my information away on here. So everything that's in the programs will be here, but it's not sets and reps and it'll be exact day to day. So you guys can see exactly what I like to do and my favorite exercises specifically, cause it's just too much and I can't just go over every fucking thing I do. And it's always changing. So I'm always changing what I'm doing. So I like to keep uh, that up to date as well because I can't, I don't like to do the same thing. It's different for everybody. Um, what I worked in the past, for, what worked in the past for me doesn't work for me anymore because my body got too adapted to it. Uh, other than that, push myself crazy hard, worked my body, recovery mode. I'm going to get healthy. Like I said yesterday, I am going to take a break. I'm going to take a month, a week or two, get super healthy, just stretch, just do some light, light plyos, hit my light by now. Light, light plyos, get super healthy, get this hamstring right. I don't know what's wrong with it. I'm pretty sure it's my lower back and hips, but I'm going to try to get it super, super healthy and get back to it. But dunking was so fun in the game. I hit a one foot, not, I didn't dunk in game, but had some good attempts. I missed a backboard one. It was I was a little frustrated that I couldn't get one in game, but the competition wasn't that good. I want re- real competition and I want 10 feet dunks anyway, but I need that technique work. I'm feeling really, really healthy, except for the hamstring. I'm feeling healthy dunking, but my technique is still not good. I want to get it super, super natural. So that's what I'm going to be focusing on for the next couple of weeks. Take a little break from just pushing the jump high and work on getting precise because I'm not that precise. I'm not that good at like, I'm good at one angle and one type of dunk, but I want to be super versatile, super natural off all different plants. What else is there? What I was going to say something. Let me see if I wrote it down. Um, for Monday. Oh, one thing, one theory. I might get back on this. Try this out for your day to be more in tune with the earth, with every, every other human, every other man, man or woman, Use, your, use every interaction, every experience as a mirror Monday. Pretend everything's a mirror. So if someone's mad at you, pretend you're looking back at yourself and what did you do to cause that? What energy are you putting out there as a mirror? So I wanted that little nugget in there, mirror Monday. Think about everything, every little, I like to think there's a lot of magic in the world because it's just, there's, the universe is too big. There's gotta be some kind of things we don't understand, like some forces or some, whatever the, you know what I mean? Magnets. Um, so anything that happens, you walk, you forget your keys, you forget it's a mirror, somebody cuts you off, what, what did you do, did you, whatever it is, use every interaction as a mirror, they say something rude, they say, not even negative, say something positive, what are you doing that caused that, think of everything as a reflection of what you're doing and what you're putting out there, that's how I want you to try to live your life, and also let me know how it feels, because I, I do that sometimes, I do it all the time, I try to think of it, um, from my reflection, everything's a reflection of you. And it's a good way because if you take the responsibility, then I'm happier more of the time because then you're, those are, you can always control yourself. I can't control what other people do. So if I think even what other people do are my responsibility, obviously there's a balance, but we have mild psychosis. You understand it. You can't, everything's going to be you. It's going to fuck your brain up a little bit, but that's what we do. We go deep in our psyche and we fucking, we're psychos, bro. And then we, we live better because of it, because we go so psycho on our own brain that when things go wrong, we're like, ah, I already know. Like I fucking missed a flight. So, oh, because I fucking, I woke up like two minutes late and then I wanted to do this and I made the plane take off early. You know, like you, you freak this. So then you don't get mad. It makes my life better. I like it. If you're part of my team, bro, we're going psycho. I'm sorry. I'm going to kind of mess with your brain Monday, but that's, that's what we do. So if you're in it, you're in it. And that's it. Let's get to on this day. On this day in history, August 1-2. It's a little 1-2. I have a little weird tick when it comes to 1-2. It's kind of magical for me. So let's see. Oh, and the first one, of course, see, it's magical. 11-2-1. Battle of Did- Didgery, the Georgian army under King David the Builder wins a decisive victory over the famous Seljuk commander Il Ghazi. God, that's a beautiful thing on an 1121. Oh, 1981, IBM introduces its first personal computer. Wow. I, fun fact, I did an internship for IBM when I was in college because I'm so goddamn smart. Whew, and my dad worked there. Okay, uh, today in film, <laughs> 1927, Wings. One of the only two silent films, the other being The Artist, in 2011 to win an Oscar for Best Picture, opens starring Clara Bow. Outstanding picture, 1929. Wings, okay. Today in music, 1991, heavy metal band Metallica released their fifth album, Metallica. That debuts at number one on the Billboard 200 chart. 1851, the first American Cup, U.S. Schooner America beats British yacht Aurora after race around the Isle of Wight. Wiggett? White? I don't know. Okay, cool. 
Who I was just about to say one more thing before we go, and I can't remember now. Before I get to the Dunk Life Daily, um, make it count Monday. All right, this is what we do. Um, oh yeah, I just wanted to say thank you. That's it. I wanted to say thank you for all the support. My podcast has been growing like crazy, doing what I can, um, and I love your feedback. I had fun doing that Dunk series, but at the towards the end, my brain was getting a little mush because it's hard for me to stick to something for so long because my my energy changes so so fast. Like I started that series, I had all the best intentions, and then towards the end, I felt like I was drifting off. I wanted to do other things, so I I, I do this podcast daily because every day is so fucking different in my brain that it's perfect for me. But I like those series. I'm gonna do other series like that. I think I'm gonna go over whenever I come up with dunk tips. I like to bring those up like uh, always. That's why it's dunk life because I go back and forth. Dunking is such a strong part of what I do. Those tips, I think, relate to life, but also are great insights. And I, I don't, I don't, I write them down sometimes, but I don't feel them, and I need to give them out right when it happens. So let me know if you want those series. Let me know what you want me to cover as well, because there's so many different things. Everybody's so unique. I can go over unique instances as well, and that's it. Dunk life, a uh, dunk lifer of the day. Julio Hardy Harder says. Love your video, man. Love your videos, man. You punch them dunks a lot. Let's go. Uh, and what else? Anyone else? Dominic Bond. Mindset is huge. Amanda Castillo. A girl? Fast for three or four days. Eat an apple or banana before bed and get all the acid out of your body. Interesting. I've never tried that. And Logan the Goat was first, he says. Okay, I'll trust him. Let's go. All right, make it happen. Let's have some mania Monday and just fucking go make some gains. Oh, speaking of gains, that's what I wanted to say. Last thing, making gains Monday. I'm going to get this fucking poster replaced with Dunk Life Daily soon. I'm getting a new car soon. That's insane. Stay tuned to my YouTube story for all the behind the scenes. I'm going to keep it strictly for the YouTube fam, everything that's happening in the most now, now. And the other thing about making gains is I'm jumping my highest. And there was something else. I'm going to keep the studio going and keep my programs going and keep you guys making gains. That's it. All right, making gains Monday, fucking Monday, make it happen, fucking more, more, more. Toodaloo. That's dunk life. Oh, that's the anthem right there. Tried to make an intro, ended up making an anthem. Oh.